With some breaking news out of Greenville County right now, we have learned the name of the woman who was found dead inside her home. And her death is being investigated as a homicide tonight. Our Kylie Jones is joining us live near Greer. Kylie, what's the latest? Well, Gabby Michael, just a few minutes ago, we are learning that woman was 41 year old Christina Parcell. The coroner's office says she lived in this home in the Cane Break neighborhood. The coroner also telling us she died from multiple sharp force injuries. The Greenville County Sheriff's Office now hoping tonight security camera footage from neighbors in the Cane Break neighborhood can help piece together some of the missing pieces of the puzzle about what happened at what they call a gruesome scene. Questions still linger after a woman was found dead at a home in Greer. It's just a good, quiet neighborhood, and to see all this was just uh, heartbreaking. Neighbors came home to the Canebrake neighborhood taped off Wednesday. The Greenville County Sheriff's Office says that woman was found by someone who knew her around 11 a.m. It's, it's very alarming and disturbing when something like this goes on in a community uh, anywhere in the county, but especially a community that is relatively quiet. I can't think the last time we've ever had an issue over at Cane Break neighborhood. Lieutenant the, Ryan Flood says they don't think there was any forced entry into the home. Now asking everyone in the neighborhood to check surveillance cameras and ring doorbell footage. Looking for a suspicious person or vehicle between 6 a.m. and 11 a.m. Wednesday. Oh, it's imperative for the community to come forward with information uh, and whether that surveillance footage or whether that's just information uh, related to the crime in of itself. We need the community to come forward. Buena Vista Elementary School is right across the street. The principal sent out a message to parents yesterday saying the victim was a family member of one of its students. Neighbors just devastated. This is such a good neighborhood. I've I've raised five kids here and they all went to school in this area and it was just a shock to see all this going on. Again, neighbors in the Cane Break neighborhood are asked to check their security camera footage, their ring doorbell camera footage for any suspicious person or suspicious vehicle again between 6 a.m. and 11 a.m. yesterday. That was Wednesday. If you have any relevant footage or just any information you're asked to contact the Greenville County Sheriff's Office, you can also call Crime Stoppers at 23 Crime. Reporting live in Greenville County, Kylie Jones, WYFF News 4.